Hi Taurus, so today this is going to be a general reading. We're going to do general energy, uh, love and career. I've never done one of these before for specific signs, so if this doesn't resonate with you, that's completely fine. I'm going back to my pick of cards again next week or in the next couple of days, so it's fine. But let me know if this does resonate with you. So today we're going to be looking into your overall energy to start off with. So Taurus, what is going on with Taurus's energy? So we have the family harmony feeling safe and problem resolved so you guys have gone through a certain issue I felt this could be to do with family I'm getting this could be like a family issue that's kind of brewing around um because I actually forgot that family harmony was there that's so funny so yeah there's something that's kind of being resolved now and it's kind of making you feel like you need to be in your safe place um, the universe is letting me know that you are safe and stand your ground for what your certain opinions are and we also have make a wish this is a magical moment make a wish and enjoy its manifestations so i definitely feel like there could be a time at the moment where you are kind of stuck in a certain situation between family members i feel like this could be to do with parents um or siblings that sort of thing if not it could be to do with love a certain relationship of some sort um but the problem is being resolved there it's being sorted everything is being sorted it's okay to feel unsafe because the universe is protecting you and it's okay to just kind of be on the edge at the moment we also have the nine of swords so this is kind of the energy that you're embodying right now this is the kind of emotion that i'm definitely feeling it's kind of like heartache like heartbroken like help me kind of energy like i need help um so i'm just seeing what other energies there are for you coming in I have the knight of swords so i definitely feel like you guys could be releasing an ex as well and then there could be a new person coming in so once this problem is resolved um there's going to be a message coming in for you guys so you could also and i feel like we've got the we've got the high priestess here as well so you guys are embodying some really really strong energy and keep working on yourself keep working on your strength keep working on your inner confidence because there's there's a new person coming in for you guys if you're single um, this could also be an, a new family member, but I definitely feel like this could be to do it with love. And this could also be a new opportunity, but I feel like definitely more of a male I'm getting. So if you're a woman, this could be a male. Obviously, it doesn't matter, but I definitely feel like I'm getting like a male, strong kind of, I want to be with you energy. <laughs> so that's, that's the overall energy. So let's see what you have in your love life. So what's going on in Taurus's love life right now? There's definitely someone hanging around, so there's someone kind of waiting to come in if they haven't come in already, or someone is waiting to communicate with you. So we have make music, creative expression, and peace of mind. So there's something that's, yeah, there's somebody really calm coming in as well, and I definitely feel like you guys are happy being single as well. There's this kind of like happy settled energy I'm feeling, definitely in your element of grounded kind of earth energy. Um, it feels very settled and very comfortable. So I'm just pulling out a romance angel card just to see what's going on in Taurus's love life. Okay, and one from the top. Okay, so we have getting to know each other and free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. So I definitely feel like, as I say, there could be some sort of like not feeling safe i feel like a couple of you could be dealing with someone you don't want to deal with or this could be your past as i say it's a general reading so it could be quite a few different options but i definitely feel like there's some sort of ties that you have with somebody i feel like you're not even conscious of these ties for some of you so it could be like emotional ties to somebody that you need to kind of let go of this could be to do with an ex, but I definitely feel like there's somebody new coming in because it says getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost self to each other, your bond deepens. And I feel like this could be like linked to your creative expression because we've got these two together. And it's almost like this person is bringing out your creativity as well. If you're a very creative person, I can see that here. I can see some of you doing like sewing or flower arranging. I'm not too sure why, but I feel like this is to do with like this happy kind of creative energy. I've also got the moon so yeah as i say there is some sort of kind of like a like a energy that's kind of like sizzling kind of brewing kind of um yeah it's underlying energy that's kind of sitting there at the moment i definitely feel like this is to do with free yourself as well so i feel like you guys could actually actually have a really good conversation with a love partner um 
in the, in the next couple of weeks because we have the moon and this is to do with energy, underlying emotional energy. So also you could be dealing with a cancer sign or a water sign. And yeah, I feel like you guys could actually have a really good conversation and it's going to be something new because we've also got the page of swords underneath. So there's something that's going to come in really, really strongly for you. Um, but just take the time. Uh, make sure to give yourself time on your own. as Don't dive too deep into this relationship yet because I don't want you to kind of lose yourself is what I'm getting. And also make music as in like you could be just concentrating on yourself, your creative expression, your hobbies. And also listen to music is going to be really, really good for you in the rest of the month. So let's see what your financial situation is. Raising your standards. Miracle healing. And stand your ground. Wow, we've got a lot of like standing your ground kind of like um, individual energy as in like you're working on yourself, you're working on your confidence, you're working on this inner power. So there's definitely a lot of earth energy here. So you're really in your element. You're really in this like grounded kind of like let's do what I want to do. I need this for myself kind of energy. So... We've got, with raising your standards and stand your ground, they're kind of drawing, they're drawing into the miracle healing. So there's definitely an energy to do with finances in like, I know what I want, or I'm trying to figure out what I want to do with money. Ow, I just bit my tongue. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> I feel like you guys are kind of biting your tongue in this situation, maybe. I don't know why. I've, I have never bit my tongue in a reading. So I definitely feel like this is for you guys. Um... You could be biting your tongue to do with somebody. It could be like a boss or a manager you really, really hate. But if you're kind of self-employed, this could be standing your ground in a situation of finances in like dealing with a certain client. It's King of Swords. So there's definitely some definite sharp energy coming forward and it's going very, very fast. So there's some sort of conversation you're having with somebody to do with your finance. You could actually be moving very fast into a new job as well. You could be establishing your... Um, what you believe in kind of what your um, standards are to do with a job So you're kind of if you are in the middle of jobs at the moment and you're figuring out what job you want to do um, there's definitely an energy of focusing on myself standing your ground raising your standards as in like it's all kind of like emotional power em Emotional empowerment. So this is really really nice. Um, I see you being very strong in your money situation So anything to do with money and confidence I'm seeing those co the word confidence and the word money are really relating to each other at the moment So however that resonates with you then that is how it is and I'm so also sorry for the lawn mower in the background um, My neighbors are mowing the lawn Thank you for watching. If this resonated with you, please comment down below. I'd love to know. Um, as I say, I have never done one of these before. And I'm thinking about doing one again. But if this resonated with you, please comment down below. I love you so, so much. And please feel free to subscribe. And I'll see you all very, very soon. Bye.